What's your reaction when I ask you about to-do lists? Most people cringe or just go, oh. It's only a small percentage of people for whom this works. And the reason is the very structure of the to-do list actually makes it 10 times harder to get them done. Today I'm going to show you a simple technique that will let you throw away your to-do lists and replace them with something that's going to move you ahead so fast it'll blow you away. This week's vlog builds on last week's which was about as if now goals and the, the key thing is here is your brain works in pictures okay not words. So when you set a goal the way you write it creates the picture in your mind. Most people say I will do something or I'm going to or you have a to-do list this is what you've got to do. So if you say I will go up this flight of stairs the picture you create is at being at the bottom of the stairs and all of that work to get up to the top. Instead to write the goal as if now to say I am at the top of the stairs. So your picture is you're at the top and you can feel good about it. That's motivating. Whereas being at the bottom is like ugh I've got to go all the way up there. Same thing with a to-do list. If you create a to-do list you create a picture in your mind's eye of all of the un finished work. So as if now goals I've used for years with all of my programs, all of my coaching clients and what I love is when my coaching clients come back and build on what I've given them and one of them came back to me uh, a few years ago and realized this thing about to-do lists that to-do lists actually demotivate you because they show you at the bottom of the stairs not having done the task. You see the office with all these piles of work things you got to do which thoroughly demotivate motivates you and he said he stopped doing to-do lists and started creating to-done lists and what he did was he wrote out his list of not what he had to do but he wrote it in an as if now fashion. So I have finished this report. I've completed uh, the prep for this meeting. I have got all of this presentation together and all of this. So the pictures he's created in his mind's eye were of all the tasks done and the feelings that went along with that were elation and excitement instead of drudgery. And the interesting thing is what he found and what a lot of my coaching clients have found since I've passed this on is that whereas it, sometimes it took all day to get through the to-do list, generally they get through the to-done list within an hour and then they're on to the rest of the stuff they need to do. So try this out. Throw out your to-do list. Replace it with a to-done list. Write all the things as if they're already complete and see just how fast you get through them.